This is not the church of Joseph Smith. Travis Wayne Goodsell. Thought I'd share with you the email I just sent to uh, Rachel Maddow. Uh, it's regarding Utah and coronavirus. So it has absolutely nothing to do with the church whatsoever, even though I did forget to put in uh, the church has closed their storehouses, <coughs> keeping Utahns away from food. But uh, I'll just read it for you. As Utah is among the last to order a state shutdown because they only have eight deaths as of yesterday at their daily 1 p.m. reporting, and then I link the website to the coronavirus.utah.gov case counts, as it is sarcastic tradition to wait for 13 more deaths before installing a street light. I had to put sarcastic in there because she may not catch on. We here in Utah all know uh, of that joke, which is not really a joke. It's sadly true. But they're getting better because it only took them three deaths before they finally put in a street light at the brand new homeless shelter and have now stopped reporting to John Hopkins as the University of Utah Medical have now stepped in to do their own research to confirm the obvious that coronavirus is a bat virus. So I link them to the ABC4 News Utah article where they confirm it's a bat virus. The state religion, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, whose CEO is a medical doctor renowned for groundbreaking heart surgery, and that's not sarcastic, I didn't put sarcastic in there, has calmed the Mormon masses by announcing a second worldwide fast on Good Friday, the Christian day when Jesus died. since the first one failed miserably. To miraculously cure the world of coronavirus with payments to the church for the two meals fasted. Governor Herbert is loyal Mormon, is a loyal Mormon, and is expected to wait until after a while after this Friday's miracle coronavirus cure fast before making further decisions. Like I said, I forgot to put in that they closed the storehouses because it's going to be cured. There's no need to give away food. <laughs> Crazy? That would be stupid. <laughs> We've got to save it for Jesus when he comes for the second coming. There you go, Jesus. Here's your food. And here's a trillion dollars that we saved for you. Is this making you happy? No, it's not enough. You are lazy. I smite you. So, since I only have four minutes here, and I'm used to doing two-hour videos for conference, and hour videos regularly, uh, I have maybe planned, we'll see what I come up with, uh, comparing the two apostasies. Two apostasies? What are you talking about, Travis? We only know of the Christian apostasy. <laughs> yes, Mormons, there was a Mormon apostasy and we're in it. So I will show comparisons on how they're exactly the same. Uh, let's see. Uh, LDS Mormon Church Mind Numbing Addiction. Um, I can't believe he called it. <laughs> I'm going to have fun with that one. <coughs> Dear, you're a mind numbing addiction, and you, sir, are sleeping with a dog. And 
so yes, I'm going to go over again uh, brainwashing uh, because uh, Karl Marx <coughs> uh, had that religion as opiate of the masses. So I'll explain to you that even in the full context, he's still trashing religion. As some people are trying to support Karl Marx by saying, Oh no, he's not trashing religion. He's saying religion's a good thing. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly why communist countries, you know, don't have religion. <laughs> they ban it. Uh, and so, uh, yeah, I'll go over that one, which I see I have zombies listed in here. <laughs> you know, after all, that Mormon goddess who's now trapped in jail because of coronavirus. <laughs> and they have to get a new judge and she has to get new lawyers. <laughs> but, you know, hey, you killed your husband. You killed your kids because you thought they were zombies. <sighs> Mormon goddess. what I'm thinking about doing for today. I still need to watch the little red-headed girl show. <sighs> and it's already 66 degrees at 6 in the morning. And I've got my air conditioning blowing full blast, so I'm not feeling the effects yet, but uh, it's going to be one of those days.